Hello everybody, my name is Mr. Craven, and welcome back to Pacific Drive. I believe this is episode... Four? Five? Five, I think. Uh, I've been doing some supply runs, um, as usual. What do you say? Sometimes I think it's just safe to assume things are going through. It may not be the same thing to think, but it definitely helps me get to sleep at no. <laughs> Uh, yeah, been doing some supply runs. I will include that footage right here. <clears throat> hey, everybody. Just woke up. It's like 8 in the morning. I found another one of these, but I think this one's a different color. This might be a different story. After the multi-stage oh, nope. evacuation of the Olympic Peninsula's 100,000 strong population, the records get sketchy. Once the region is swept clean of civilian eyes, the flow of information trickles to an eventual stop. Arda has always maintained that the evacuation was done in the name of national security. That there was simply nothing more patriotic than sacrificing your homes, with the communists plotting our demise across the Atlantic. Certainly not because there was any danger from the strange experiments happening inside, or situations most unnatural to witness. Arda kept the wide berth, displacing citizens far ahead of the front line, so first-hand accounts of things going awry were rare. But rumors spread fast, and everyone had some story about a distant relative whose pet changed in inexplicable ways, or a friend of a friend who followed strange lights into the woods and never returned. Once the civilians cleared out, the Arda employees moved in. Scientists, officials, support staff, and their families made the Olympic Exclusion Zone home reaching anywhere from 300 to 1,000 in total at its peak. What any of them were doing in the zone was kept hush-hush, but the population just outside the walls found the secrecy irresistible. Every shipment of raw material, out-of-season weather pattern, and inexplicable light or sound became the talk of the town for the first decade of the zone's existence. Damn. I can imagine living in a place and then the government just being like, hey, you gotta leave, but we can't tell you why. But don't worry, it's because of those Russians. Like, some shit like that. Hell yeah. What? How many... Huh. So wait, I got two thermosap in exchange for five gear? That's in, that's a horrible exchange rate. That is a horrible exchange rate. Ugh. I thought I'd stumbled across like a good uh, way to get some thermosap. But no, that is awful. All right. Uh, cool. Well, at least I tried. That's that is a horrible exchange rate. Awful. Horrendous. Cool. I will keep going. Hello. Uh, finished my supply run. Oh, hold on. Something's wrong with my battery. What is up with you? Unreliable. Okay. Let's go ahead and. Chuck you in here. Yum, 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 yum. Okay. Let's go and make a new one. Uh, also, I got a dumpster pearl. Let's see what's inside it. Also, I learned that you can swap tires uh, mid... Uh, mid journey. So that is good news. Is that empty? Yes. Okay. Yeah, let's crack this dumpster pearl open. Damn. These things are fucking loaded. Junker steering wheel? Nice. Let's actually see what we've picked up so far. 
We got lawyer. Let's do that for a while. Uh, oh! Cool dog. And there's crystal. Yeah, let's see what that is. Uh, okay, lawyer. Let's install him for a bit. Oh my god. Install. Okay. Crystal? Uh, let's see. The Junker steering wheel is just a pair of pliers. Let's check that out. Uh, then shifter. I love the Astral, so I'll keep that on, but I really want to see what the crowbar one looks like. Powered by carbs. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That should have been like the default, like when you first get it. Oh, that's insane. That is some trailer park Bubba. Like, that is, that's wild. And the crowbar. Cute. All right, let's undo all that. Yeah, um, let me do some upgrades and stuff. I might do another supply run. And then do the story. We'll see. Actually, let's see what the crystal. I didn't even look at that. Cute. All right. Um, what else we got? Cool dog. Uh, let's put... I really like this this wheel. And then let's get the galaxy shifter back on. The wishing star back on. There we go. That is a cool dog. I'll leave him for a while. I <laughs> love that. Cool. All right. Um let me do all my stuff I gotta do, like repair, uh, swap gears, parts out. Ooh, there is a diagnostic. Okay. <clears throat> hmm. All right, let's see what this is. Alright, let's go ahead and just do this. Give me a hint. Okay, so battery. Decreases. Ugh. Uh, battery is full. Battery consumes faster? I don't know. Okay, so when battery is full, got that. Okay, so it's not wipers. So let's go ahead and get the battery full. Yeah, nothing turned on. Yeah, battery's full. Huh. Let's try opening all the doors and give it another charge. Let's see if it closes it. Yeah, now the door's closed. Hmm. 
Yeah, battery is full. Inverts direction? No. Okay, so it's not car. How about dashboard? No. Okay, so something with the headlights. There we go. Okay, needs electrician's kit, which I think I actually have. Yeah. Perfect. All right. Sickening. Um. So I still have. I need to make another electrician's kit and more ceiling kit. go. Let's put that in here. All right. Yeah. Let's finish up here the garage and I'll do another, yeah, I'll do another supply run and then I will do the story. Oh, also here's the limb chip I need to research, but that's going to be in the third area, I believe. Dang. All right. Uh, it looks like I'm nearly done researching shit. Ooh, high capacity battery. Let's go ahead and get close to that. High capacity battery needs unstable energy. Sick. All right. Uh, all right. Let's cut to the next thing. Another dumpster pearl. Whoa, I actually have two of them. Sick. What the fuck is happening? Okay, let's not get hit. All right, let's keep going. God damn. Hey everybody, finally found some more of these. Delicious, finally. And then... Twisted Ember. Are you tree candy? You are tree candy. Or is that it? Uh, these might be some right here. I need a lot of tree candy, so I'm gonna go ahead and just give these logs the suck. Yes, come here. Come on. Yay. 
Yes, join me. Join me in my adventures. Aid me in my endeavors. I keep hearing, like, frog noises. Okay, I think that's it. Perfect. So I got some thermal sap and I got some tree candy. This area was actually worth it. Last couple supply runs I've done have been... Nope. Fucking useless. Okay. Perfect. There's a big storm coming in. Perfect. Because I'm just about to leave the zone. Okay, make sure I'm not missing any more tree candies or sap collector thingies. Get out of it. Get out of it. Jesus Christ. I might just switch to all-terrain tires permanently, because that just fucked me. That just fucked me real bad. Oh my god. Also, I learned that this stuff that I'm running in right now is hot dust. So I scan that, so the next time we go back to the house, to the garage, we can craft something that needed hot dust. I got a fully formed liberator. It's a little beat up. Uh, but. Now I can actually test it out. Um, let's try it on this platelet. Oh, nope. So it shoots out a little explosive device. So I wonder if I need to use that like on a car panel? upon a time I thought I'd be able to solve the instability issue. The solution was within my grasp. But that's ancient history now. Aw. Who knows? Maybe me and my handy dandy little car will help you fix it. Probably not though. Alright, uh, let me repair everything, and then we will do the next story. But also, I think I might have enough thermosap now to build the engine. Let's see if make a new hammer. Uh, yeah. Actually, let's try this really quick. The Liberator. And so it has that much HP. Oh. Sick. Not sure why I would need that. That's pretty nice. Hey. 
Okay, let's see what's in these pearls, shall we? I mean, damn, damn. That's a lot of electronics. And it gave me decal the numbers. All right. There's another one. Be nice if we give me like sap or tree candy or something. Damn. These things are fucking stocked. God, shut up. What? That's one small step for man, one giant leap for a man. What the hell is that? Aliens? They keep hinting towards aliens. Blue paint? Oh, that's... It's number six because it's on my hotbar. Got it. Sick. Uh, yeah, let me keep sorting out the inventory and repair everything. I'll cut to the next thing. Yeah, I noticed anything going on. Horn is honked. Did I, oh wait, did I try the hood? Horn, what are you doing? What's happening? Okay, so... Horn is honked. No. Uh... Wipers switch off? So it is the wipers, okay. Let's go test the wipers one more time. Okay. Ah, they stop. Okay. Okay, got that one. Horn is honked. Wipers get stuck. Sick. Hey, the fix is mechanics kit. What <clears throat> mechanics kit? What I ha which I have. God, my voice just gave out. Okay, now the next one is car. Let's try car brakes. Fuel drains? Nope. Okay, so it's not brakes. It's not fuel. Receives. Okay, so it's not warps. How about... Okay, so car's off ground. Something happens. Okay, it's not wipers. Damn. I think I might... Yeah, I'm out of guesses. So, I will write this down for the next time I come back. Anytime we're off the ground... Okay. 
car off ground. Question mark. Got it. All right. Now that that is out of the way, let's see what I can research. This allows you to use a scanner charge to send a modified signal to a junction, scrambling it. That sounds pretty nice. So, like, if I don't like how the junction is laid out, I can do that. Yeah, I might do that. Uh... Oh, sick. I thought it was going to be part of the antenna. Sick. Okay. What else can I do? Um, I can research these, which I don't really care about. Yeah, like that Liberator, I'm not... 100% sold on. Doors. Impact resist would be nice. I don't know. Paddle tire, which I don't need. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, high capacity battery. Here we go. That's nice. Mmm. Okay. And the only thing left I can do is this. Which is the one where I had to research hot dust. Yeah, there's something I had to research. Hot dust to, um, to get. Hmm. Ion shield? Oh, is this one? Ah, damn. All right. I'll get that one next. So I think whenever I use this, I think it's an ability. So I think whenever I use this, it will uh, let me not get fucked up by like shit like hot dust. All right. Uh. Unstable energy. So this is what? Roof floodlights? Eh. Bio headlight? Still don't understand those. But health is 60. And right now mine are only 60. Or 50. Ooh, but also... Ah, oh, I need to find a tour bus? Blech. Blech. Alright. I'll save, I'll save the energy. Um, so I have 50 tree candy, which is nice. Ooh, let's go see if I can make the new engine. Still cannot. Jesus Christ. I'm never going to be able to make this engine. <laughs> never going to be able to make this. So annoying. All right. Yeah. Let's take a break for a second so I can go shower. And then, when we come back, we'll head out. Yeah! I just got some repair putty from the friendly dumpster. Thanks, bro. I appreciate ya. Uh, yeah, so, while I was out, I actually figured out what was up with the car. So when it's airborne, something happens. I did a easy supply mission just to kind of test that. Uh, so boop. So when car, uh, where is it? Is off ground. Radio switches on. Okay, toggles. Sick. Oh, I have two more! No! <laughs> no!
Oh my god. I have two more quirks. This isn't fair. All right, V. Uh, radio. Okay. Uh, let's go play with the radio for a second. Let's turn everything on. Interesting. Okay, so when the radio is on, it fucks with the wipers. Okay, so... When radio stays on, wipers... It's either get stuck or move slow. How about wobbles? There we go. Okay, let's fix that. I feel like I'm taking drugs when I do that. <laughs> okay, and then hood. Okay, nothing switched. Okay, let's turn. Ooh, got it. Nope. Yeah, got it. Okay, so when the hood opens, the right door opens. Got it. Turn that off. Damn. I expect to come back with some many quirks. Okay, so. Hood open. Wait, is it open? Yeah, okay. Hood is opened. Right front door opens. Bam. And let's fix that. I'm about to make some more mechanics kits and stuff. Sec. Um, let's see. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Boop, boop. Okay. Yeah, so we're gonna go do the next story mission. Very exciting. Also, I put the all-terrain tires back on. I am just so tired of being off-road and just like skidding everywhere. I'd rather drive a little bit slower and have more control. Um, let's see, what's in here? I have a headlight cooking. Basically everything is still fine. Like, bumper's good. Everything is pretty well taken care of. Actually, hi. Let's put all-terrain tires on, because these are just off-road tires. Yes. Perfect. Yep. Yeah, because I have enough uh, tree candy to make these now. Perfect. So that means I'm going to have nearly as good of control 
whenever I'm off-road as I do whenever I'm uh, on the road. And it won't slow me down. Damn. Oh yeah, here. That's how many I have. Sick. I'm... I can't tell you how excited I am to get these on. Okay. One more. I might just tear up those puncture ones, too, to get all the materials back. There we go. Sick. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Uh, let's see, to make the puncture-proof ones, I'd use thermosap. So I might actually get some thermosap back. By tearing these up. Yes. I love the vacuum so much. And now with my thermosap back. Do I have enough? No. Fuck. Fuck. I'm never, never getting enough to make this. I'm going to be stuck with the default engine forever. Ugh. God damn it. All right. I'm never getting enough thermosap crystal. I'm just never going to get it. Never going to get it. Never going to get it. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Okay. I could always get rid of the auto parker to add that uh that battery. But the auto parker is so nice. Yeah, it's really worth it. Alright, here we go. God damn, look at this. Okay, so I could go heavy fog, the Warrens. Ugh. Malfunctioning mess. Oh no. Then the Warrens still. Okay, so I go heavy fog, harmful to humans. I think I'd rather do the Warrens. And then fuel evaporator. Ugh, God damn it! All right. So that last one means it's going to just eat through my fuel. Stop it. Here we go! Yeah, we have to go to like this like research place. Damn. Yeah, these new tires are good. These are worth it. Damn. And they're all terrain. Uh Alright, so we're going. Spark surge, no. You, I guess. Okay. What do we got? We have... Oh, yeah. So I'll just swing up through here. Ooh, what is this? I think that's a repair station. But I don't need that. If only that I had seen one of those earlier. Yeah, these feel nice. Like, I don't think they're as high of a road rating as the puncture proof tires. But. They're definitely worth it. Okay, let's go get this. Let's go ahead and hit control. Oil barrel is there. Don't need that. 
All right, yeah, this is a very chill zone. Is this another plasma thing? Yes. Leave the light on so I can see. And I'm not going to be out very long. Oh, there's three of them. Uh. Block. Block. And... Ow. Oop. Bonk. I think I have so much broken glass now. I can probably stop picking those up. So, like, if I don't suck them up with a vacuum, I might as well pick them up. Sick. Also, I noticed uh, while I was editing that I, I look down like this too often. I need to keep like this. It looks better for the video. Is this another plasma thing? <gasps> okay, it's gonna zap. There it goes. There you go. Thank you. My eyes. Yeah, how's it going, everybody? The overall reception of this series has been very, very good. I was a little worried that people were going to be like, this is insanely boring. <laughs> but I think that since I am timestamping it, like, here's the story stuff. Everything before this is supply runs. Bonk. I think people are into it. Space? I don't see the research station out there. Here, let's test out the new tires. Ah, they're grippy. Where's that? There it is. Hi. Come on. There we go. Thank you. There's that research base. I'm gonna just hop up in here. Oh wait, oh shit. Oh shit. Okay. Damn. I was so close. Oh. I was way too close to the uh, the grinder. I keep hitting the windshield wiper instead of the keys, or vice versa. Okay. Wake up, sheeple. Oh my God, I keep. Fuck it. I keep leaving my uh, headlights on. What, no chemicals? Rude. I need chemicals. Man, this one was a waste of time. Rude. Okay. T. Also, I was sent a key uh, to a new game called, like, I think it's called like, Winter Survival or something. It looks like a really good game I can play for Survival Sunday. Oh, shit. Okay. Is 
fan. I love survival games. Okay, let's hop out real quick. Hi. Bye. Now it's time to leave. Let's get out of here. Yeah, this was a good zone. Nice and easy. Got a lot of plasma. Got a chance to test out the new tires. Oh, it's the geysers. Which, I've examined these, right? Yes, okay. The shaker. Sick. Easy peasy. I know the next zone's gonna fuck me up. Okay, so we have a bunch of options. This is the Warrens and Overcharge Electricity. This is just the Warrens. And it gives Unstable Anchor. This is harmful to humans. Um, but it has a Salamander Grotto. Hmm. This has two things that I haven't recognized yet. Uh, let's go. Let's just go here. Jeez Louise. Like, the longer these, these trips are, the more I'm like, can we please get, like, a halfway point somewhere? This is insane. Okay. Right off the bat, I'm like, is that something out there? It's a car wreck over there. Here, let me hop out really quick. Yeah. Anytime I see big colorful spots like this, I'm like, what are you? Nothing. Damn it. All right. keep hearing, like, mechanical scraping. Yeah. There's so many, like, colorful things out there, but those aren't anything. So I keep getting, like, sidetracked. Oh, sick. Perfect. Okay, let's suck you up. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, delicious. Sucking on some trees. I need to find like 20 more of these. No, no, fuck off. They're gonna rob me. Get away. Fuck your mother. Oh shit, okay. Lots of tree candy. I examined you. Burp bunny, ew. Oh, 
Gives chemicals. Nice. Um, well, now let's go ahead. Ooh, more trees. Oh my god. Very exciting. Yeah, I'm turning these into fiberglass or carbon fiber or something. Uh, get some electrical resistance stuff going. Aw, pretty. Fireflies? Oh, okay. Radioactive fireflies, love it. <laughs> All right. this I keep being faked out are these fucking mushrooms that's another tree don't grab those damn I need more thermosat please 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 Pretty fucking please. Ugh. Yeah, that's like in the middle of a bunch of bad shit, so let's not do that. These bouncing guys fuck you up. I need to read through the theories and stuff. I'll do that eventually. <gasps> this is thermosap shit? Oh my god, I think it is. It is. Oh my god. Ew. Fucking assholes. I might, maybe, possibly, have enough for that engine now. Let me get back. Is that another one out there? First off, what are you? Are you protecting anything? Did I just fuck up my engine? I think I did. Alright, let's park up right here because there's so much shit around. I am ecstatic. Okay, what's in here? Uh, I think electronics into marsh egg, which... Nah. Not a good trade. 
crowbar. A fully formed crowbar. Sick. Okay. Have I scanned this? Yeah, hot dust. Got it. I actually just figured out earlier in this video uh, what that was. Okay. I already have 44 of the uh, thermosaps. I think that means I do have enough to make the engine. Sorry, my train of thought is so fucked whenever I'm looking around. That's one thing that I've noticed about myself when I commentate is that whenever I'm trying to examine stuff, I just lose my train of thought. Like, it is just out of the station. All right. Let's put you up. Let's get you out. Well, no. Fuck, I didn't get another puncher, did I? No! Fuck. I didn't make another puncher. Impact hammer. I need gear, which I can... Craft and gas cylinder. All right. Like, I doubt I can get gas cylinders from electronics. Yeah. Okay, time to leave. It's getting gross. This is a good zone. Yeah, it is. Time to go. Shit's getting angry. Oh, another thermosap thing. Uh, but let's get out of this. I don't have a smasher. Fuck. We're going to get a gas cylinder. I can't tell if that shit expands or not. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. I'm not even heading towards the exit. Damn it. I got so distracted by farming. Bar out. Let's go and grab vacuum. I know I'm gonna need that. Damn it. I can't believe I didn't make another smasher. I wonder if I can get a gas cylinder from these things. Oh, never mind. Time to go. Time is up. No, no. Okay. Uh, I'm getting nuked. I'm getting absolutely microwaved. No. Fuck off. I think better not have pulled something off me.
No, I keep missing the exit. Okay, hold on. Right there. Damn it. Oh my god. I'm panicking. It's not bad. It's fine. It's fine. Where is the turnoff? Okay, here it is. Yeah, if I had more time, I would try to go to more research stations. Because I think I can get gas cylinders in there. Something's wrong with that side battery I have. Once you get out of the zone, I'll figure out what's going on with the side battery and with the engine. Here we go. And I gotta see if that that grabby thing took anything from me. Fuel evaporator. Fuck. This one I just gotta try to get through as fast as I can. I might not even stop to grab stuff. Maybe. We'll see. I love loot. <laughs> okay. Let's... Park it. Okay. Did I... Anything get ripped off? Okay, looking good. Now... I mean, everything looks fine. Uh... Battery's half dead. That sucks. Ceiling kit. Okay. Nope. Let's get these out and the ceiling kit. good and battery's good. Sick. Alrighty. So why is my engine... Oh, it's not my engine. It's this. No? Oh, it's just beat up. Alright. Before I... Move on. Let's heal those. There you go. So I definitely don't want to lose those. Okay. Uh, a bunch of research stations. Kind of like out in the middle of nowhere. And I believe this zone has low time before the thing closes in. Before the storm starts. Damn. I really, really wish I'd made another smasher. Misplay. Fuck up. If I see an Arta truck or something, I can always try in there. Fuck. Gotta watch out for the bouncy things. How did I get hit? How did I get hit? 
I was so careful. Is this a armored truck? I really don't have time to loot that, especially next to this thing. And what is this? Why? Why is my... Oh. I was in a acid thing. T. I got pressurized cartridges, but not the thing I actually need. Hmm. Yeah, all right. Let's keep going. Yes, I know I'm on an incline. I know. Where is the... Ooh. Let's get this first. And then I'll go get that energy. Teal paint, I don't need you. I am so full of paint. That is just like a nightmare over there. Don't explode on me. Thank you. Cool. We are just going to get out of here. I think we are already at the story point. So maybe if I'm fast enough, I can do two story quest today? That would be nice. Okay. Cars and stuff. Trees. Alright. I think we're good. Oh. Actually. I see you. Let's go check this Arta truck before we go. There's usually some good shit in here. Spare tire. And Olympian Fragment. I finally got one. Sick. Explosives? Damn. So I got two things I'd never seen before from that one truck. Oh my god. I thought it was like so slick with that turnaround. <laughs> Just putting some explosives in the in the trunk and then careening down a hill. No big deal. No big deal. And I think the story missions typically have uh like permanent stability until you beat the mission. So in the next area, I can just kind of hang out. Let's see what's in here before I go. Come on. Garbage. Trash. And yeah, this place definitely did evaporate my fuel. Like, I'm at halfway. Even though I have that backseat tank as well.
Here we go. There's three things in here that I haven't examined before. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's... Oh, this place looks insane. It's like a neighborhood. Okay. Fill up my tanks. God damn. God damn. Okay, so I gotta do the suck suck on some. Didn't I? Wait a minute. Didn't I fill that before I left? Everything else seems fine. A little beat up, but no big deal. Sick. Uh, wipers. Yesterday, you up to your eyeballs and paperwork? Francis coated in chalk dust from the black horse. You mistaking my lab notes for a trash pile and throwing away weeks of work? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It'd be nice to see it again. They bulldoze that facility to the ground. There's nothing left to reminisce about. Well, damn. I like how they're, I mean, that one guy really hates her, like really does not like her, but I like how slowly they're kind of becoming friends again. I wonder if by the end, like all three of them are going to get together or get out. Really curious. Okay, so that's full. You're full. Why is my car creeping? Oh, I left it on while filling it up. Whoops. That's not good. Fucking explode. What's actually the worst thing that can happen if you fill up a car while it's being filled up? Or while it's on? you regret all this? From the very second I heard your voice coming through my speakers. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, everything that happened, handing over the the way the project ended, it, it cost you hell you know, your career, the entire... The Olympic Peninsula, which is still here. So are you. You chose your urban legends over everything else. And you wonder if I regret it. Oh, I have no interest in regret. I want to know if you ever felt that leaving was a real option. After everything I've seen and heard and felt here? No. Not a chance. 
Then we have that in common. God, there's... I kept saying I'm never going to get enough of those... Uh, crystals. But now, like... I'm seeing so many of them. I can't do anything with them. Maybe if I get the plasma cutter, I can do enough damage to them to bust them open. Here, let's try the normal cutter. Ooh, this is so slow. Oh, man. Yeah, that's so slow. It's not worth it. Maybe I can get like a science research place. Like there. Why is it? There we go. Oh, I thought the waypoint was just randomly moving. Okay. Yeah, maybe I can get like a gas cylinder or something in here. How's Francis? He's, uh, he hasn't left the bedroom. I'm sorry. You didn't know about his demotion. It wasn't my secret to tell. It's fine. This is between him and, and me. Fuck. Oh, damn it. I can't even get in there. Oh, I can make one. Uh, when did that happen? I didn't even realize I had enough. Okay. I bet you're screaming at your screen. Hmm. I don't think I need those. Maybe I do. But also... I think I learned that the uh, exchange rate is really bad. So I'd rather just farm them. Garbage. Garbage. All right. Uh, did I get everything out here? Yes. Cool. Yeah, let's go back and get some more of those thermosaps, because I want to be absolutely sure that I have enough to make the engine. Like, I'm really curious what upgrading the engine does. Does it make me go faster? Does it make me, like, accelerate faster? Self. I need to start making more uh, smashers and vacuums and all that stuff. over this way. A few different cars. And an energy thing. I'm kind of worried about 
I'm grabbing the energy. That one just spawned. It, this one just spawned in. That is incredibly lucky. Like free energy. Fuck off. God damn it. Go away. Fuck, I hate those. Let's get out of the way. Then I'll go back and get that other energy. Okay. Moving tourist, hello. There we go. Now I think I have enough energy to leave. Okay, love it. What is that? I think I've seen it swirl around like that before. Maybe I have. Yeah, hot dust. Yeah, I guess that's it. I've never seen it swirl around like a tornado before. I know not every place can be just chock full of loot. But some of those are just useless. Full of garbage. And it's in the secondary zone. So I'm like, how can you be so poor? more thermostat holders. Yes! I also need some lead platelets. Hello? Oh. The shitty bouncing orb thing is after me again. Oh no, it's spread around my car! Rude! It didn't even alert me. Dr. K's lab has got to be here somewhere. I'm looking. Don't worry. That's probably where the giant green thing is. Ugh. So what, uh, what, what, what did Alan tell you about his work? Second in command of Dr. K's lab, after all. Alan didn't discuss his work with me. Nor did I share mine with him. Wait, you were ahead of the whole stinking department. You must have known something about what their lab was doing. Uh, if there was anything useful to be found, I'd have sussed it out already. That's all I did after the accident. Try and fail to find any answers. 
What the fuck? Ow. Bitch! Ow! Let's go heal. <laughs> oh, wait. Ow! My head! Ow! <laughs> Every time I bonk my noggin, I get a very hearty chuckle out of that. Uh, were you protecting anything good? Yes, you were. I don't need fabric. I think I have like over like five stacks of fabric back at the base. Okay. Um, so I'm so looty tooty when it comes to the storyline. Through door. Yeah. I just want to upgrade my car. The remnant thing is definitely working on me. I am obsessed. I do wish the storm would stop. Invisible wall next to the actual wall. Yeah, there is. Oh no. All right, I have to teleport the car. Yeah, there's an invisible wall next to the wall. Turn that off. Uh, I do need plasma. What the fuck is this? Yeah, what the f Oh my god. It's it's spewing. Oh my god, it's spewing. Uh There we go. Cuz I need to get down this ramp. Oh my god. Well, I thought I had made it to the ramp. What? There we go. 
What do you mean? No, why would you put it there? No, you idiot! Okay, I gotta get some more thermo shit. But also, oh, fuck it, no. So how do we get out of here? It's like, this door is open or is it closed? Oh, it's open. Dr. K's access records were coded to the lab that used to be here. I'm feeling less optimistic by the second. Not a scour this place clean. Uh, something's here, we just can't see it. Oh, following a hunch. <laughs> Not your usual MO, Oppy. No, but being suspicious of Arda is. Okay. So I just need to drive around? All these like interior, like super dark areas give me like horror vibes. And like there's lights over here. I don't know if there's anything actually over here. Garbage. And like on here it shows there's like an exit. So I probably need to reverse, but let's go ahead and go look down this way first. Oh I know this was a shoot these guys are gonna hit my car oh well thank you for not doing that Ow. I really need a new chair like my ass hurts so bad right now my buns are screaming I wish I get a standing desk or stop being such a fat fuck Yeah, it says there's fuel down here, so I guess let's head down this way. Yeah, there's a fuel barrel in there. There's more shocky boys over here. All the tunnel access? Where? Whoa, drive, hang on, wait, where, where are you going? That should have been the end of the facility. According to the blueprints, anyway. What are you talking about? Here, let's go ahead and... Blast. Oh, in there. Okay. I can do that. Give me a tight squeeze. It's worth a little bit, little bit of lube I can get in there. Here we go. Ooh. 
What the fuck? Oh, this is sick. Security protocol activated. Scan artist security credentials immediately. Um. No? Well, well. After all these years, an artist still has something to hide. <laughs> We're definitely onto something now. Driver, anything you find down there, scan and transmit it back to us. We'll work on disengaging the security protocol. Okay, I can do that. Let me get all the plasma. I guess I'll leave that one active for now. Just in case it's charging anything up over here. There's an Arda Phenomena okay, report. Here's something. Oh, hold on. This thing in the deep zone, they called it the well. Oh, fantastic. Tobias, My run those butt. reports through the decryptor and see what you can find. Ugh. There we go. All right. I think it's it over here. Oh, when we get back to the car, I need to get rid of that waypoint. A plasma. Uh, remove a point. There we go. to ruin a good urban legend with a bunch of sides. <laughs> Fine, I'll read this one myself. <laughs> Aww. Nice work, driver. We'll review these and summarize our findings after. He's actually being kind of nice. Alright, here's a shock tower. Probably just drive past this. Ooh, hearing ooky spooky stuff up that way. Yeah, what's up here? Hello. Panel. These lab notes are complete gibberish. What about these diagrams, though? It looks like he was trying to convey something. You can admire the doctor's newfound art skills all you want. You won't find anything useful in them. <laughs> God. All right. Um. Boop. Hop back in the car, and then also I'm gonna pause for a second. I need to add like a pillow under my butt. Ugh, leave a like for my butt. Ugh. All right. Like, I need to get out and just take a look at that really quick. That looks incredible. Can't scan it. Damn. K. 
Okay. Random tourists in here. Hello. Okay, as long as they don't start moving. Fuck. Can I make another one? I can! There we go. Picking those up. Wait. There we go. Okay. Oh, damn. So to get into this area, I gotta kill the tourist. There we go. This is a decrypted record of the accident. Arpy, are you sure you wanna hear this? It's got details about Helen's final moments. It's been over 30 years. I'm past ready. Go on, driver. Keep snooping and see what else you can find. All right. Don't mind if I do. Ain't gotta tell me. God damn, there's so many of these things. Normally, I would maybe just pass them up, but they're just so localized that it's just easy plasma farming. Pass it up. That didn't hit me. Even though it like clearly went through my body. Oh my god, I'm so glad I explored and got more gas cylinders. Butterflies? I meant to get over there. How do I get over there? Nope, nope, nope. Uh oh. Oh, okay. I thought I was dead. Um. go. Alan's lab notes. Maybe my late husband sent us something useful from the grave after all. Aw. And you're all clear. Give us a moment. We'll let you know what we found in all this data. And make your way back to the auto shop after you're done scouring the place. 
Okay. Thank you. No problem. See, she's being so nice. At first, she was so surly. So, I wonder if there's actually anything here? Like, is there anything I can scavenge, or is that it? Because I haven't found anything to actually loot up in these areas. Like, I can't cut anything up over here. I haven't seen, like, a chest or a locker or anything. Like, I guess I can drive around. Fuck, I really want to get up there. where I started. Yeah, I think this is where I started. So I've gone a full circle. Okay, so I'm assuming I go up through this tunnel. We're back outside. Is there anything on this side? There's a little car. Garbage! This car that's up here is in a, an armored car. Usually those have some stuff in it. Gear off so I don't go right into that acid shit. No, no, this is just a regular car. Son of a bitch. So they had me go to the next area anyways. Weird. Usually they had me leave. Oh god. Usually they just had me leave. So I'm curious what I do. Do I just make a... A jump point or whatever? Black roads. Um, yeah, I guess I can loot. Driver, you hit the jackpot. We've got a lead on what you're heading toward in the deep zone. Tobias, give us a rundown about the well. Auto classified it as a hot spot of ultra high energy gamma radiation. Disruptions were spontaneous, and ultimately, Autumn made no conclusion about what caused it, when it would blow, or how destructive it would be. Ada, of course, wanted to control this bottomless well of energy. So they brought in Dr. K and Allen to research activation and containment. They discovered a way to reliably trigger the well, and that was the remnants. And that's what the remnants have been leading people towards. So I need to go... Hmm. 
to like the source of everything, of course. This second report's a good one. Ready to hear where the remnants came from? The original remnants were created in Dr. K's lab. Huh. They aimed to create a trigger for activating the well. By infusing objects with a carefully calibrated limb wave, the ones that share a resonant frequency would... Yeah, yeah, just get to the good stuff. <sighs> You know, you'd be a much better ghost hunter if it weren't for that unfortunate attention span. <laughs> Reading this makes it obvious how the remnants ended up in the wild. Wait, wait, what, 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 how? The gamma ray surge that caused the mass hallucination event. That energy irradiated everything within a 10 mile radius. Objects with the right characteristics absorbed that energy and became the remnants people found out in the zone. Huh. Wow. Francis would get a kick out of that one. <laughs> Tell him later. I've reviewed Dr. K's lab notes. And now we know what he was doing in that lab after the accident. Spinning in circles for years. His injuries were real. Dr. K's radiation exposure should have been fatal. And the minute he could stand on his feet again, Arda shuttled him right back to his lab and bit the monkey to dance. They allowed him to carry on in the hopes that he would reproduce anything useful. He worked for two whole years before they quietly retired him from his post. <laughs> Sorry, we scrambled your brain. Here's a pension. Bye. <laughs> I mean, that's what they do. They use you up and spit you out. You've got that accident record ready, Tobias. It's time. Okay, then. September 14, 1961. Mm. Arda's finalized report on what happened that night. Dr. K and Alan were testing the activation potential of lab-created remnants. That night was a run-of-the-mill remnant test. Nothing out of the ordinary. The remnant in question was a tungsten cube. At 3.23 a.m., the cube was brought towards the well. The well reacted at nominal levels. However, at the 500-meter distance, the cube was sucked into the well and triggered the gamma ray surge. The energy output continued ramping up, and at 15 seconds, showed no signs of stopping. Then, a Alan... Go on. I can handle it. Dr. K testified that Alan engaged the suppression protocol, then the kill switch, both of which failed. Dr. K ordered Alan to get to safety, but Alan... Alan insisted on staying at the controls. Only when he flipped the radiation polarity did the energy output plateau, then collapse back into itself. Sweet. Alan's gamma radiation exposure was fatal due to his proximity to the well. So he kind of saved everybody? If it weren't for him, the entire zone might have gone under. That's who Alan was. Loyal until the very end. I'm sorry, Oppy. I'd expect nothing less from him. Damn. Once that car gets to the well, we can expect another gamma ray eruption. We'll need a way to cut it off. And I may have found the answer in Alan's lab notes. His work on that suppression technique is... What's interesting is Dr. K and Alan didn't know any more than we do now. They had no conclusions about what the well is. Or what the remnants did. Or how they interacted with this well. Maybe they're ladles that scoop out a metered amount of gamma radiation. Maybe they trigger an eruption that we can't stop and will destroy the zone if we get it too close. That's a hell of a range. What are we going to do? We keep going. But if it's an eruption... I already sacrificed the Olympic Peninsula once for new tech. How many chances for total and utter fallout does a gal get in her life, huh? Ha <laughs> ha In another life, we would have made a fantastic team. In no universe would I not have murdered you in your sleep. <laughs> Jesus. But she loves them in her own weird way. Like... I think she's just been alone for so long. She doesn't know how to like, I don't know. And she always like worked alone too, so I don't know. Maybe she, maybe this is just how she is.
Because she always worked alone. So now that she's actually working with people, after like 30 years. Ugh. I like to think she's not a total bastard. Um... There's a truck up this way. Then after that, I'll probably... Go back to the garage. Because my car's getting fucked up. Walk up here. Come on, come on. Skyrim, you can do it. Sick. Yeah, I got more explosives. Oh. Storm stopping. Probably means I need to get out of here soon. I was hoping I could find more, like, swamp eggs, or... Uh, coral something-something-somethings. But I don't think this zone has any. Come on. Why won't that close? I think I have a quirk in my car where the door won't close. I have to research that. Oh boy. There's not something sticking to me, is there? I'm gonna get nuked. What the fuck just happened? Yeah, my entire car door just got ripped off. It's gone. I've never been hit that hard. I mean, maybe I have, but I hit the uh, the shield button too. Out of there. Got you, man. The Red Meadows records. God damn. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> now we go into the deep zone. Easy peasy. Except for the issue of the old wall. Right, yeah. That. Uh, you got some genius idea up your sleeve, huh? Is that how you think it works? That scientists can't up genius at will. Well, yeah. Do you? Oh, well, in this case, I do. But don't expect it to work like that every time. Driver, the quarantine checkpoints will be the best way through the old wall, but they're death traps in their own right. But I designed something to help. Check out the blueprints I sent over. I had an impact hammer in here. Or am I... Oh, wait, no, that's, that's my inventory. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Okay. Let's put everything up. There we go. Um, 
Let's see what you want. What's wrong with all my questions? They're <clears throat> the questions of a sane man. What's happening with all the test dummies in the zone? What was Raymond doing with his hands? How did the old ladies turn into Russians? What? What? Old ladies turned into Russians? And also, I might need to actually get another locker going. Because I am running out of space. Okay, let's go put this door on. There we go. Alright. Um, what should I do? What should I do? I guess I can try to make the new engine. I like how I started this episode being like, I'm never going to get that engine. Uh, and now look. So the amp engine is swamp coral. Yeah, I need that. 360 swamp coral? Fuck, man. Sick. Um, boop. Do I drop? Sick. Car of Theseus. Replace all uh, the car's original parts. So, can I just chunk this guy? Damn, I can. That's a lot of scrap metal. Damn. That was actually worth it. Um. Flip that. That's full. All right. Let me go ahead and repair everything and swap parts out. And then I will cut to the next thing. Sick. I made an ion shield. Okay, still replacing some parts, so I'll cut to the next thing. Okay. So, we know that if my car is off the ground, I think its radio turns on. Nope. Uh... Go and investigate. Okay, so car moves downhill. Um. Let's get one more time. No, I'm enough energy. So, if car moves downhill, is it radio? No. Wipers. No. Battery drains. No. Dashboard flickers. Okay, so it's dashboard something. There we go. Oh, that's the only one I have. Okay. Sick. All right. Everything is repaired. 
I have lots of extra tools. Like I have two hammers, two grinders, another thing. Um, I could use another plain vacuum, I guess. Yeah, just a regular one. Uh, another plain flashlight. Yeah. Throw that in there. And I think I have... Yeah, that's fine. So she said there's a track. Somewhere. Oh, whoa. This thing is hauling ass. This thing hauls ass now. Oh, that's incredible. All right. Well, let's go ahead and end the video there. When we come back, I think the next mission, we're getting inside the next wall. Uh, pick up the blueprint from, oh. Um, okay. What is this? Craft a limb shield? took up residence in the crossing points. It's not enough to have a shield. The shield itself needs to be shielded. The energy drain on that shield is massive. It won't last you more than five seconds. Yes, and? You'll need to recharge on the go, but the zone's grid is completely dark. You know, what if we could reroute our power into the deep zone? But we'd need to jumpstart the network somehow. That car is basically the world's most overpowered electromagnet on wheels. The driver induces a current, then you open the electrical floodgates. And they'd have to induce the current the entire way through the old wall while making the crossing and maintaining speed. I don't know what to tell you. If you don't believe the driver and that car's got what it takes by now, then go back to hunting ghosts. We've got a job to do here. This could work. Are you in, Francis? I, I, I don't know. Look, we have a real chance of losing everything at the old wall. I'd like to not fail this far along. How can we know this will work? We don't. That's how science works. We form a theory, and we test it, and we fail, and fail, and fail, and only sometimes do we succeed. Come on, Francis. Please? Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> All right. The team is assembled. Nice work on that limb shield driver. We'll have the power grid prepped by the time you reach the old wall. Sick. All right. So, next storyline... Our next story mission, we're going in. Oxidize, needs a ceiling kit. Uh, boop. Let's see, ceiling kit. Let's go into that. Oh, I need to make some more of those. Cool. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed. Um, when we come back, going into the new, I guess the final area. We're getting close, it might only be another, like, one or two, like two or three parts to the series, and then we're done. So yeah, I'm gonna miss it. I love this game. Well, cool. Thanks for watching. See you next time.